हेलो चिल्ड्रेन गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन यस इन टुडे इन कंप्यूटर साइंस वी आर गोइंग टू सी नाउ लेसन नंबर सेवन वर्किंग विथ स्लाइड्स लेसन नंबर सेवन वर्किंग विथ स्लाइड्स यस सी नाउ You all know presentation. Presentation means made up of slides. Presentation means made up of slides. So introduction. What is the introduction? Formatting is an art of designing a slide which makes the entire presentation effective and attractive. So we have to format the presentation. Then only it looks very effective and attractive. Any presentation needs a basic layout to insert objects. There are several slide layouts available in slide layout dialog box. So, page number forty-two. Can you see the slide layout is also called as auto layout. Slide layout, what we call as other name is auto layout. So now in title step, can you see now every presentation? If you open now, you can see one title slide and subtitle. Uh, box two rectangle boxes can you see na there yes so in page number forty two there are uh, things where we can insert can you see the pictures that chart is given media clip is given pictures is given so in the box there are many things in the right side can you see the that you can insert now we we'll go to title and content this layout contains space for typing all title. and a sequential list of text perfect by symbols called bullets you can choose insert table insert table the first picture can you see the first picture children insert table chart the colorful blue yellow red no? can you see no? that is only chart smart art another is a smart art graphic down the you can see the mountain with the sun no? that is only picture from file another is clip art another is insert media clip these are the icons display in the center of the slide okay what is table a table means a collection of related data placed in the form of rows and columns how it is placed in the form of rows and columns chart it is a pictorial representation of data in the column line pie bar charts are there smart art graphic it is a visible presentation of information that can be created by choosing different layouts picture from file you have taken one picture and saved it that picture you can save in the slide okay you can insert in the slide you can insert the personal favorite pictures from the file stored in our computer now clip art what is clip art here na collection of ready made pictures clip art here is a collection of ready made pictures media clip here we can insert video clips related to our presentation no blank slide Go to page number. Next page, children. Page number forty-three. Yes, in the top you can see the blank slide. This layout contains a blank slide where any element can be created. You can insert that text, clip, part, table, whatever you want to insert. You can insert there. Here you can position elements at any place on the slide to make it more attractive and creative. To make it more attractive and creative, we can do this. so content with caption can you see this this layout contains space to add title and text content on the left side of the slide the space on the right side is provided for the caption where we can place any graphic such as chart table so right side is meant for this you can place any object there like chart or table which relates to the text on the left side so here can you see the picture children the first picture shows the click to the add title second picture shows the title slide second picture is the two rectangle boxes are there na the first one is the add title second one is subtitle okay so the other one is what title with content second picture that is the third one is the blank slide third one is a blank slide fourth one is content with caption so you can write the content one side and add. other side you can add the caption and the fifth one is picture with caption so you, on the top you can place the picture where in the down you can add the 
titles the picture with caption this title layout has an icon in the center when clicked we can add picture to the slide from the file stored in our computer at the bottom of the slide we can click to add title for the picture and type few lines of the text about the picture you can also add few lines about the picture now children turn page now page number 44 inserting a slide now we are going to insert a slide in the presentation is a collection of slides by default powerpoint provides one slide while creating a presentation to add more slides in the presentation click on home tab select new slide command and choose any slide layout so first what we have to do to add more slides what you have to do first click on home tab select new slide command and choose any slide layout we can also insert a new slide by clicking an icon in the new slide command by doing this a new slide is inserted in the same layout of the previous slide objects on slide a well designed presentation exhibits its impact to the viewer when it contains different elements these elements make the presentation more attractive attractive so if you insert any object like chart picture shapes word art table it looks more attractive inserting shapes now shapes are in build drawing such as circle rectangle symbols etc available at the click of the mouse button there are nine different types of shapes they are lines rectangles basic shapes block arrows equation shapes flow chart stars banners and call outs and action buttons to insert a shape on the slide click on the insert tab select shape command and choose any type to select a shape to insert on the slide can you see the so in the shapes if you click on down picture see the children down picture shapes yellow if you insert there if you click there you can see different types of shapes lines rectangle slip available now yes now we'll go to the next page children inserting clip art inserting clip art a clip art is a inbuilt picture gallery in the powerpoint application to insert a clip art on the slide click on the insert tab and select clip art first we'll go to the clip art then we have to go to the insert type and select clip art command The clip art tag span appears on the right side of the screen. Type the name of the picture in search for. For example, computer. Click on go. A list of computer pictures will appear. Choose a picture of your choice and click it to insert. So in this, there are two pictures. Can you see the children? Now you have to choose any one picture and we can insert on the slide. This is inserting clip art. Next, inserting word art. so word art is a stylistic way of writing art so can you see so many types of a capital a represented in so many styles so it makes the text appear colorful and give a special effect on text to insert word art click on the insert tab and select word art command 30 different so how many types there there are 30 different styles are there and for the alphabet a select any one of the style by clicking on the text box appears on the slide saying your text here start typing your text then you select the style insert the tab just you can choose a quick styles option to apply other styles to take your style so this is done by selecting the text box after typing the text and then click to the quick styles option to apply the other styles to your text now we'll go to the next page children Here you can see now your text here. So in that many types of capital A is there. We can select any one style and we can text type here. Animation and transition. Animation is a way to move the objects on slide. In other words, you can way to move the objects across the slide equal either manually or automatically. So animation is what when we view any cartoon picture, it's a moving. The object is moving. Okay. so while so running a slide show whereas the transition is a process replacing one slide with another during slide show the difference between the animation and transition is occurs within the slide animation occurs within the slide while the transition occurs between slides the transition occurs between slides let us now discuss how animation and transition are used on a slide 
to animate any object on a slide click on animation tab and select custom animation option the custom animation dialog box appears on to the right hand screen can you see the can you see the picture down animation we have the custom animation option yellow color yes we'll go to the next page children the custom animation dialog box appears as shown below can you see the custom animation box here the allows you to add effect to the individual element of the slide by clicking on the add effect button we can choose the effect from the list and apply to the element this is this can be done to all elements on the slide under modify options we can choose the direction and the speed of the animation we can also specify the start of the animation in custom animation we can preview the animation by clicking on the play button can you see the picture children there in the left side you can see the play button yes the slide show button shows the preview in the full screen if you play now it will show the full screen now step 1 how we will example to animate a slide first we have to go to the home tab new slide command select two content layout slides and design the slide to your imagination from the animation tab click on the custom animation option the custom animation task pad appears so first we have to go to home tab new slide command then select two content layout this slide and design the slide then after that from the animation tab click on the custom animation option the custom animation task pan appears now select the object to be animated from the slide and choose any one of your favorite animation from the add effect option for example add effect gives entrance gives fly in click on the preview button to view the view of the animation now we have uh, go to the preview button to view the animation in the slide layout click on the content to area and type text and animate it if using emphasis option in add effect text type now these are the steps children how we will animate a slide to apply text page children to apply transition effect on the slide click on the animation tab and select transition patterns of your choice given below so you can choose the speed of transition you can also move to the next slide by choosing the mouse click automatically after specified time given in the advanced slide option can you see the transition effects these are the transition for the picture can you see fades and dissolves one another is wipes transition so the animation the transition effects can be viewed by running a slide show by running a slide show we can view it now down we have the fill in the blanks caption c a p t i o n caption clip part c l i p a r t clip part word art w o r d a r t word art transition t r a n s i t i o n transition add effect e d d e f f e c t add effect so these are the missing letters children kindly copy in your textbook children now we'll go to the fill in the blanks so dash is an art of and designing a slide formatting copy in your textbook a clip art is a inbuilt picture gallery in a powerpoint dash is a way to view the objects on the slide animation number 4 content with caption layout contains space to insert a title with a sub subtitle number 5 custom animation allows us to dash to an individual element of a slide to add effect number 6 word art is a stylist way of writing text number 7 presentation is a collection of slides number 8 to add a slide in the presentation click on home tab and choose new slide command Number nine, a table is a collection of related data placed in the form of rows and columns. Number ten, transition is the process of replacing one slide with another using a slide show. So kindly copy it carefully, children. All the spellings. Now you will go to true or false. To insert shape on a slide, click on home tab is false. There are nine types of shapes available. True. animation occurs between slides falls 
bullets are the sequential list of text prefix by symbols true slide transition option is available under insert tab false now can we go for the next page children here we have to name the slide layouts the first one is picture with option second one is title slide third one is blank slide fourth one is title and content fifth one is content with option so you have to write the name the slide layouts okay first question here what is formatting formatting is an art of designing a slide which makes the entire presentation effective and attractive write a note on clip art table clip art is a collection of ready made pictures a table is a collection clip uh, about click art you writing now collection of ready made pictures a table is a collection of related data placed in the form of rows and columns placed in the form of rows and columns name the icons here on the top left is insert table chart second one third one is smart art graphic down the left side is picture from file middle one is clip art whereas the last one is insert media clip okay now fourth one how will you insert a slide into your presentation click on home tab select new slide command and choose any slide layout insert a new slide by clicking on icon in the new slide command now fifth question what are the objects can be inserted on a slide the objects that can be inserted on slide is table chart picture clip art shapes and word art etc how do you apply transition so for picture see the pictures children the first picture is in this insert tab chart smart art graphic picture from file clip art and insert media now so the fourth question i am reading out listen click on home tab select new slide command and choose any slide layout insert a new slide by clicking on icon in the new slide command what are the objects can be inserted on the slide the objects that can be inserted on slide or table chart picture clip art shapes and word art etc now sixth question how do you apply transition effect on the slide how do you apply click on the animation tab and select transition patterns of your choice given in the animation tab our seventh question is write the difference between the animation and transition animation occurs within the slide while the transition occurs between the slides okay the eighth one is the naming we have to name the types of shape the first one is line shape second one is rectangle shape and the third one is equation shape and the fourth one is square shape now ninth question how will you insert a word art to your slide click on insert tab and select word art command 30 different word art styles appear shown with the alphabet e now 10th one explain briefly about the content with the caption slide layout this layout contains space to add title and text content on to your left side of the slide the space on the right side is provided for caption so children kindly write all your exercise and question answers in your copy in your in your textbook children copy in your computer textbook children thank you children